Do you have a plan for your own personal growth? Or do you spend your time trying to avoid conflict, avoid challenges, avoid struggles in order to look good? What's your goal? Is your goal to improve or is your goal to look good? You know, people with a fixed mindset, they don't think they can improve. They don't think that there's anything more they can do. They think that what they have or what they are and who they are, that's all they got. And so they never try to improve. They never go out and find more skills. They'd rather avoid making mistakes if it was at all possible so that they can look good instead of trying to go out and, and improve themselves because they just don't think that they can get any better. You know, that might work for a while. You might get along pretty well for a while, but then everyone around you starts to move on. Everyone around you starts to outpace you. Everyone around you start is growing and getting better and you're just stuck. So that's really not a good place to be. You know, people with a growth mindset know that the solution to the problem that they're dealing with is really inside them. And they need to, to go work and find it. They know that they can find someone else. They can find a book. They can find a video. They can find a podcast. They can find a mentor that can help them get the knowledge and the skills that they need in order to grow. They're constantly evaluating their own thoughts and they're constantly evaluating their own perceptions that might create limits in their thinking and limits in their abilities. They know that by gaining knowledge and focusing action on what they can do, that they can move past their, their own self-imposed limits. They can get past those limiting beliefs, those limiting thoughts, and grow. So to speed up your own personal growth, you need to have a growth mindset. What you think in your mind is what you will get. You know, you've heard it said, as a man thinketh, so is he. It's true. Whatever you think about up here is what you're going to be. It's what you're going to get. So focus your thoughts on what you need, what you want to accomplish, what you need to discover and discover how to get those things. And if you focus your mind on what you need and what you want and what you need to learn in order to accomplish, then it's it will become real. It will happen. And because of that, because as a man thinketh, as a person thinketh in their mind, so is he, so are they, you need to be careful of negative thoughts. Negative thoughts are just as powerful or more powerful than positive thoughts and a positive mindset. Your limiting beliefs are what are holding, your back, holding you back. It's not a lack of skills. It's not a lack of training. It's not a lack of ability. It's what you believe up here. It's your mindset. If you don't have a growth mindset, you're dying. You're, you're shrinking. You're withering. If you're worried, so, so think about it this way. If you're worried about losing your job, guess what? It's probably going to happen. If you're afraid of being broke, I promise you, you struggle with your finances and you have a hard time making ends meet. It's because this is driving your thoughts continually and then it becomes real. If you have limiting beliefs, you can change that with a positive mindset. You can change that. Get rid of those limiting beliefs and believe that you can, you can grow, you can do more, you can learn more. If you believe that you can succeed, if you know that you will succeed, then you can count on that happening. You can count on that coming to be. What you think in your mind is what will happen. As long as you think it continually and with passion and with hope and all those things. I mean, if, if you keep thinking life is going to be bad, life is going to be bad. If you think life is going to be great in the future and you keep thinking that, you will find things to make your life great. If you want it to happen, then your mind is the best tool that you have to create it. 
So you need to make sure that you're giving your mind the right tools and the right fuel and the right fertilizer and nurturing to grow those ideas and to grow those beliefs in order to make it happen. I say all the time, it's that simple. I didn't say it was easy. I said it's that simple. So, if you want to grow, personal growth, if you want to be successful, if you want to have more in your life, then you need to put that in your mind that you can have it, that you can accomplish it, that you will succeed, and keep those thoughts every day in your mind. Right? I'd write them down so you can see them and read them every day. Because your mind is the best tool that you have to make it happen. Just make sure you're giving it the right tools. Don't have limiting beliefs. Don't have negative thoughts. Don't have the, oh, poor me thoughts. Have the, wow, what if I did this? What could I achieve if I did this? I want to do, have positive thoughts and continually keep those in your mind and your mind will attract, truly attract to you opportunities to make it happen. So, like I said, Make sure you're giving your mind the right tools, the positive beliefs. Go out and get the skills and knowledge. Read books. I talk about reading books all the time. Watch, watch videos. Listen to podcasts. You know, read blogs or, or you know, read articles online that will get you the skills and the knowledge that you need. And use the tool that you have in order to create the success that you want in your life. Because once you put all that in there and you are continually pushing forward to get better and to do more, eventually you'll see it happen. I'm Mark Schinner. This is your Thursday Thoughts. I hope you have a great day today and I'll be back tomorrow.